All right, we are in the uh, Canada Nine Hole Cup. We're in the final round, and the scores are absolutely crazy. So I came in with a uh, 16, and in the bracket that I, my opening round or qualifying bracket for the Nine Hole Cup, there was a 19 at the top. I think there was two or three 16s, and then down from there. So it's wide open. I think. If we look at the holes, there's, you know, 15's like pretty much the base score. So you got to get more than that. So getting a, every hole has an opportunity, a really good opportunity, actually. Some of the holes aren't as good as the others, but I mean, you have a great, if you put yourself in the right spot. So the whatever's at the top right here, I, I'm going to guess that it's, you're going to have to shoot better than a 17. That, that's what's the goal that's a grim <laughs> so I'm not looking up at the top because I don't really want to put any pressure on myself I and it's the same way I never look at the scores that are at the top but I know that the scores up at the top that are, are gonna be out of this world so it'll be a tough uh, tough get but here we go let's go look at hole number one hole number one we're playing let's do rookie All right. Now I know if you come out and do OP, you can do this with a three power ball to get up into this zone, but I really want to get up into that zone without having to do overpower. So I'm going to bring a five power ball and think I can use my big top. Eye. Which way's the wind blowing? Let's get all that stuff going. All right, all right. Let's pick uh, pick our stuff here. Actually, a Thor's hammer might not be a bad choice, but I'm gonna bring my big top. Uh, kind of distance I get. A little, I know we're 12 yards short, but we get. <sighs> so I'm not having to pull back from my red line. I think my my extra mile might be might be okay. Either one of these. I'm going to take this bag. But I'm going to swap. I'm not going to use... I'm not going to need my Guardian here. So that sh that bag should be fine. And let's bring a 5 power ball. Here we go. Here we go. What was I doing on the drive? I have no numbers for the drive, so... There you have it. Yesterday in pro, we came out and we were the this tailwind is really pushing you forward. So yesterday in pro, hell, we were like five rings away from the sand, pulled out the wind, put half the wind back in, and still ended up in the sand. So if the wind's blowing five, it's blowing ten. <laughs> We've seen that a lot here in the last year. They haven't... Uh, the winds seem to be a little bit higher maybe in Rookie than they, they were in the past, but the deal is... Uh, nah, I guess I can just bring a power three ball. Only need a power three. All right, that's good. That's good news. I don't want to have to waste that ball. It makes it even better. Let's swap that ball out for a, uh, we'll take a Kingmaker Heartbreaker. Three miles an hour, that should be a ring and a half. I'm gonna take out a ring and a half. I'm gonna put a half a ring back in. Yep, 
hitting it perfect. Let's see how much run we can get on the other side. That should be nice. Just right. Just like mama used to make. There are a lot of these holes you can get on and you can bring a navigator, or you can bring a quasar, or you can bring a lower power ball, but if you find yourself in trouble, that lower power ball might, uh, my opponent was able to recover, but sometimes that ball can bite in the butt. There's Max, there's Man, eking at Man, about 25%. Two, four, 2.3 rings. There's two, three. Perfect. Get in the hole. Oh. I added on plus one. I needed to add on plus two. Urgh. I should have did a two five. That was that was like two three two four right there. It's close. I added on just a titch. I needed to add on just a titch more. That's the first time this week I haven't made that. Darn it. Dag nab it. All right, back to the drawing board. Okay. That is definitely a hole that we wanted. No dice. Okay, which way is the wind blowing here? Get a little bit of, okay, we're doing, this is a rough bump with 10%. Uh, Sniper and a nav. Just looking at my looking at my notes on this hole to see what I had here. Sniper. Nav. Navigator. Sniper and a nav. That's all we need. That's all I need, damn it. Alright, all I need is the wind. I'm doing a 10% adjustment, I'm doing a rough bump. And I'm playing I'm playing it at max even though I'm at minimum club. And I'm adding on 10%. So with a sniper I think it's 1.2, so that's like a 30% adjustment. If I was playing minimum, it'd be like a minimum and a 30% adjustment. Somewhere in that neighborhood. Four one. Four point four rings. Four point four rings. There's four, four, exactly. Isn't it perfect? <laughs> I, that's what's gonna happen to me on every one of these holes. I'm gonna be 1.1 off on every single hole today. 
that's going to be the that's going to be the the deal i think i was close on those two close close Just a bit outside. Now, I was leaving it like my opponent right there. I was leaving it right at the cup because it's kind of going downhill, but it, I, it was the ball guide was not lying. I was It was left me right there. So hopefully my opponent gets everything good. good. And we'll see if they got their distance right. One ring great to the left. You can't tell because it went down into that dip, so it rolled down and picked up a little speed and then rolled back up to a stop. But if it goes through the cup, it's going uphill. Then it drops down to the cup. Can never tell. I was hoping they'd hit that perfect. I'm sure they were too. I started shooting a video earlier today and we were watching a movie last night and my wife came out and I decided I needed to, I don't normally script my videos but I do need to write down a couple notes just so I have a game plan. Dunner's nephew started playing and it's been a long, long time since I've shot a wind ring. So I have an account my 99 account which has never played a, a match higher than tour five but i played a lot i played six or seven hundred matches now well, maybe a little maybe a little more in that up to level five i've got several of my commons almost maxed out and now i got the hiccups uh-oh that's bad i need water agua all right, hole number three. Hole number three. If I can get rid of my hiccups. All right. Now, in rookie, we really want to get here and go for the shot. And I was bringing out. And the second shot should be a Max Kingfisher if you get into the right area. Hold on one second. All right, that was the longest five minutes of my life. As much as I, I love sneezing, as much as I love sneezing, hiccups are on the other side of that scale. I don't get them very often, but when I get the hiccups, I get them really bad. <laughs> you gotta address it right then. <laughs> All right, let's make sure I don't get them again. We'll just take deep breaths there for a second. Let me go back and look at that hole so I make sure I got it. All right, I was using, I think in this account, I have a, let me look at my, it seemed like I was using a, is there a power? Looks like it will work. And I have an extra, extra mile. Alright, that's the bag. That's the bag, that's the ball, let's roll. Hopefully everybody's having a good tournament. This is this is one of those tournaments that like right there, I on those first two holes missing that close. That's two shots. There's no way, there's no way I have a shot. Like the very first hole, you can screw it up, and this is one of those tournaments you have no room to screw up. So even if I pick up, what, I got seven holes left. If I pick them all up, I put me a 19. That might win. <laughs> I think I'm going to have to shoot better than a 16 for sure. I'm, I'm thinking it's uh, it's got to be... It, I think that there's somebody up at the top that's got a massive score. I don't even... I don't even know if it's 16 will get you a banner. Maybe. It, sometimes when you get into these tournaments, especially in the full tournaments, everybody peaks in the opening round. And you go into the weekend round and you're thinking, wow, this isn't going to be good. And then you shoot a pretty decent score. You know, like everybody's trying to shoot a 30 and then in the weekend round you shoot a 29 and you're like, 
you know there was like 20 people at 30 in the opening round and now all of a sudden nobody could get to 30 it happens that way sometimes it doesn't always happen that way somebody steps up but I am 100% positive that this is not going to be a, a banner tournament Isn't it perfect? And we'll see if I overdrove it. Underdrove it. Oh! I'm that is. I've had the same spots and you're in the rough, but that is that right there getting into the fairway. That it's gotta be one of the closest into the fairway shots I've ever had. In 20,000 games, that is close. 99.9 .9 times out of 100, that is still going to be in the rough. Close. I was a little hesitant there because I put on all of it the other day and I shot and I ended up... It was like on the second or third bounce hit the fairway and then it got a, like a regular bounce and went all the way. It bounced over the other side <laughs> all right uh, I'm in my Saturn where am I at in my Saturn about mid club Perfect. Just a bit outside. I should have did a max adjustment there instead of a mid. That'd have been one six. That'd have been perfect. I was able to get up there in my Kingfisher in previous rounds. And it was hitting at max club, and it was actually it was hitting at max club, plus zero to the cup. That's why I played it at. Uh, where am I? Got notes all over my desk. Where is my long iron Saturn 2-4? I played it at 2-3. Yup, I played it at mid and was still off. Arr. That's like a yard away, so that's like three feet. That was, it cracks me up how they do the math, how they measure this measure stuff in this in this game. Because it seems like on the drives and those shots, when it gives us distance, like we're you know. We're hitting that distance, but when we get on the green, the distance is all skewed. In the hole! All right. Minimum score in the first three holes. And 
nothing nothing all right this par three right here Let's see which way the wind's blowing on this that wind works good for us I'm gonna do okay so let's see here we're in Grizzly and Nav Grizzly any bag with a Grizzly any bag any bag any bag with the grizzly and a navigator I don't have any uh, low okay now we're all jacked up I do have some low wind balls bring one of them we'll bring one of those all right what are we playing with here 15 I'm going to do 15%. We were doing 20, but it wasn't enough. Or it was too much, excuse me. Try 15 with a Grizzly. We'll see which way the... How much wind we got. Alright, I'm ready. Here we go. The reason I'm, it's taking me a little longer is I'm... I'm, I'm I'm getting ready to shoot these videos on doing wind ring stuff, so I'm uh, using the app. I'm using the Golf Clash Notebook app. I'm doing the math both ways. I think I'm in Max Club. Mm, no, I don't think I am. I'm not sure where I'm at, actually. Here we go. I haven't made this hole this week, so I've made just about every hole on here, even though we've only had a little bit of practice in just one round of play. Perfect. I see a lot of people do that where they don't adjust out the wind and then they put curl in it to try and that's not the way to do it. Definitely, definitely not the way. Two, five. Where am I at in my club? There's max. There's man, there's mid. I'm at like three, I'm at like maybe 65%. Mid, two, seven. Two point seven rings. There's two, five, six, seven. Isn't it perfect? Dead center perfect. Just <laughs> a bit outside. And there I should have did twenty. And we've been in twenty and we've been on the other side. That was a little bit different spot than I've been doing. I've been a little bit more to the right and having to put a little bit more spin on it in order to get it to the cup. I tried to straighten it out right there so it was rolling out straight. No dice! We're we just going to shoot the minimum score minus 12. That's definitely not going to get us anywhere. I know that there are a couple holes here coming up that we we got to get, no doubt about it. Hole number five, straight wind. This is a hole right here we that we definitely, definitely, definitely got a shot at. I'm taking this bag right there, and I am taking... I'm trying to do the first bounce rough bump. So you can do a second bounce rough bump with a... Uh,
with a, with your sniper, but I'm trying to get up there with my guardian and just do the first bounce. Take another one of those precision balls. Let's work. All right, one less than max topspin, but I'm gonna do two less than max topspin because we got tailwind. And I'm using my Thor's hammer, so let me set that stuff up. Drivers, Thor's hammer. I'm doing plus 10 on a drive with a power four ball. And the wind is going straight with us. All right, we're ready to roll. Here we go. Getting out on that course. So how many people out there, you can comment in the video or how many people out there think like the game has been out long enough that for new people playing the game, like giving them a, giving them an opportunity to buy a starter pack or where they get uh, like all their commons to level six or level seven, and I get some rares to level four or five, or get them up there. What does everybody think about that? Is that too much? Do they need to suffer like everybody else? I'm going to put that back on there. I'm going to put most of it back on there. Three. Three. Oh. 2.25 rings. Or 2.5 rings, excuse me. Dead center perfect. Now it's all about distance. Don't run, roll, stop. Excellent. All right, now we've got the, the, the guardian. I'm doing We were doing plus 10 minus 1. Is going to be going like that. Nice. That area will. Uh, I don't hit over to that area, but I've seen other people hit over there. Wow. Do I have enough room? Jeez. Ooh, the power four ball. Damn it. One seven. Two point one rings. I'm going to do two. Hitting a dead center perfect again. Let's hope it has enough to get out of that. It was hitting a little fat in it. <laughs> and I should have, should have. I should have added on like point two. Everything's close. Everything's close. Nothing's going in. And even with the power four ball, I barely had enough to get me there. That's that thing about getting as deep as you can into that hole. I suppose you could do what my opponent did. They could come out of that direction. I need to go back and watch this to see what they did to get out there. I'm not exactly sure where they hit to. Ah, uh, I know what they did. Dunner was showing... Dunner was talking to me about it. He's like, "Why? I can't believe you're not doing this shot. I don't remember what they're doing. They must have watched Dunner do it and got the, and then you're going to get the, Ooh! Uh, 
so close. Everybody's just right on. All right, in the hole, back to the drawing board. Kind of having fun, but not getting any good results, I can tell you that. All right, what hole are we on now? Hole number six. I'm going to have to... Hole number six and hole number whatever the next par four is, hole number eight. I think we got to get both of these. I think this is a must. And for whatever freaking reason, this hole has been like kicking my ass. I switched to the outside and I'm gonna go back. So what I was doing on this hole, let's let's go, let's go look at it. So hole number six. So what I was doing at the beginning of the week was I was coming into this area right, I think it's right here and then trying to come through the trees to come out. But I switched over here because I liked the fact that it gave us a little bit, it was a little more open. But I've been having problems ever since I came over here and one of the times I came through here and I don't know how, I missed the rough entirely and hit right here and ended up on the other side of the freaking sand. I Right here is fine, but I'm gonna go back to this shot and try and get it to go over and I should be able to get that amazing stuff done with just an extra mile. And a Kingmaker. Kingmaker! All right, here we go. I was at the plus one mark. Four and a half top spin, two left side spin. I must have been using a Titan. A Titan! The king of balls! Which way is the wind blowing? Let's look at this. Yeah, okay. We will use the kingmaker. If I can get an opponent. I tried to get a hold of Dunner today. I was going to play our, see if we could hook up and play our pro accounts, but couldn't get a hold of him. He was going to go uh, to the driving range today. I guess he's got a golf tournament coming up here in the next couple weeks, next month. One of the people he's playing with wanted to go to the driving range today. Here we go. Now, this should be a hole that we should be able to get. Let's see if they hit that branch. Dunner hit that branch. Looked like he was going through there and everything was good. And clipped it. Looks like a, that dog might hunt. Yeah. That is, that's what you're looking for right there, bro. Unless you got a long ass putt. Yeah, that's not bad. Not bad. Not bad. I'll take, I'd take that. Perfect. <laughs> yup. <laughs> yup. That's what I've had happen to me every time on this hole. I think I've been in the right spot once, and I think I've taken this five times this week. Sorry. 
next time we play this hole, I might do it before we before we leave this tournament. I may go in and practice this hole several times and figure out, find a spot that I like because those spots that I'm hitting from, I don't like. I don't like them. Damn it. Dag nabbit. All right, all you got to do is hit this perfect. All I got to do is hit it perfect. was definitely not perfect. Distance was good. Perfect was would have been better. Minimum score. I'm going to give you guys a lesson on how to shoot minimum score. That's what, that is the whole plan today. All right. All right. 60 times whatever the wind is. Sniper and a katana. Any bag with a sniper and any ball that says katana. You know, two power. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, here we go. Here we go. Spinning. We got the summer major next week. I haven't even looked at the holes on there. I I saw that we can practice them, but it's I have a hard time if I'm playing one tournament, then starting to play other holes and starting to think critically about it. I like to wait until one tournament's over before I start looking at the other one. I normally would do a walkthrough where I could just look at the photos and we could do the walkthrough, but since they've changed the course completely, we'll have to go out there and practice it in order to do a walkthrough. 3.62 rings. There's three, six, two. Hitting it perfect. That was a 60% adjustment. And <laughs> I went right where I aimed it. Right where I aimed it. All my teammates have been playing this today and they're like, we're doing the 60%, but we need to set it up to the to the left in order to get it to go. No spin. I've been doing two backspin on it. That's why I set it up slightly left. And you can see my opponent set their slight. It looked like, to me like they set their slightly up to the left. That was a pretty big, pretty big pull. Perfect. And there's a blow in the hole. Yep, that's the view. Is that it? <laughs> Is everyone getting close but not getting no cigar? Oh my. No a bueno. Alright, let's see if we can pick up one so we can at least shoot a 13. Even on the bad shots, what have I taken seven shots and probably been the way that playdemic measures distance, maybe three whole yards. Hell, I'm not even gonna get to 50. Hole number eight. All right, all right. Is it hole number eight? It is hole number eight. In the wind here, I was using a, uh, a five power ball. I'm, I'm, I was sitting here thinking I, I played that pro account yesterday and we used a 
I think you can get up there with a three power ball, but you got to do overpower in Ricky. I'm going to, we'll start with a five and I can always go down. Start with an APOC. As much raw power as we can get. APOC. And a power five ball. Power five. I'm doing, what am I doing to the cup? I was doing plus 10. And the wind's blowing in that direction. All right, I'm all ready. I'm set. Let's get her done. Got everything put, plugged into the app. I have a lot of people who go, I can't believe you have the app. You have the app? I've had the app since the, I think, it was definitely the first month that it came out. I played a tournament. I played, I got the app and I used it so that I could get used to, used to using it. And then I played, I played a tournament with it and I was, I went back and I kept track of the win, whether it was the app doing the math or it was me doing the math. And I went back and watched the video and I didn't do as well in that tournament as I thought I should have. There's a lot of the holes that I was like, man, I would have played that different. <laughs> Three nine, three two, three point two rings. I'm gonna do just the three. Hitting it perfect. See if we can get one hole. Or I can get the eagle. Pick up one shot. I picked up one shot in this whole round. And I've had actually a pretty good round. I've feel pretty good about it I haven't shot the scores that I want where you're going you who and all that stuff but I have been have been pretty close I put myself in a spot where I think I think on every hole so far I've had at least a shot at it on the par fours I didn't put myself where I wanted that is a little too close to that edge there when you're on the edge like that sometimes it it can hit it and you you get that same rough bump effect and sometimes you hit that close to the edge and it hits real real thin and the ball goes a lot faster than you want it on the other side and it's easy to blow past this nice nice that dog will hunt in the hole and i, I yes for everybody out there, I could have brought out any ball other than a five power, any of the threes, a four power ball, whatever. But hey, let's get one. Let's let me pick up one. Come on. Woo! <laughs> Finally. Okay, I only need to pick up six on this last hole, and I got that covered. I think we can get a hole in one on the last hole, right? Hell no. Hell no. Oh. Hole number nine. Let me look at it. I know what it is, but let me look at it. Okay. Plus 15 on the drive, and I'm taking my extra, extra mile. I'm taking my bag number one. I want that Saturn in that bag. That's important. And I'm taking a Kingmaker. Here we roll. What am I doing on the drive? Plus 15 on the drive. Power three ball. Here we go. Spinning. I 
I am kind of curious to see how they've changed the, the course. I thought, I've, and I, that I have thought that some of the newer courses that have come out, they've made them a little too easy. I'm just wondering if they've gone back and changed them, how, how, how much more treacherous they are now. It should be five topspin. At the plus eight mark. I'm gonna pull back to the plus eight mark. Five topspin. My opponent, I think, was at like the plus 13 mark. And they hit it great to the right. Close. <laughs> nice shot. That's that dog will hunt. Plus eight. Five topsmen. Three, four, five topsmen. One point six rings. If I can get lined up with the wind. One six, here we roll. Seven thousand rings, great to the right or left. Now I'm in a spot of bother. I don't know that I'm in the club that I want to hit. I. I'd like to be in my, I brought that Saturn because it's got more topspin than my Grizzly. You can get up there with a Grizzly, get a bit like half a ring away from the rough. I'm trying to do a rough bump here. And I really didn't want to be that close to the rough. The Saturn gives me a little bit more ability to, a little more topspin. I can stay a little bit better in the rough. I have no idea what club I'm in now though. So I'm gonna have to do this math by hand. That's fine, that's fine, because I got no idea. And I'm definitely, oh, I'm still in Saturn. Wow, I'm in Max Saturn. 1.9, one ring. Plus point two. Let's get lined up with the wind. One point nine. I'm gonna just do plus point one. Getting it perfect. <laughs> That's the story of the round right there. That is the story of the round. That's funny. 13, shit, that's not even gonna put me in the top 50. That's funny. Anybody wanna make bets on who's at the top? I think that there's gotta be at least a minus 18 itself. I think that minus 18 is at the, well, the way the way, I think that minus 18 is the winner. Maybe 17. We will see. And I know it's not 13. I can tell you that. Oh, it did put me in the top 50. Amazing. Amazing. Let's see how far the 14s go up. 14s. All the way to 26th. 15s. Down to 12th. 16's dominating the top 10. Ah, 17 start at 15th. Or excuse me, 5th. 17, 17. Here we go. 18 at the top. King Arthur. Cheers. Nice. Nice. Very nice there, my man. 
Very nice. That's a nice round. All three Alvies. That's awesome. That's a great round right there. Is that the par threes that they missed? Didn't get the par threes, but got everything else? Very nice. Very nice. Let's see how they got there. That's also very nice. Good rounds. Good rounds, everybody. Congratulations to the people at the top. I am not one of them with a 13, only picking up one shot. I'm at the top of the 13s, and that's just because I came out with a really good qualifying round, or opening round. But uh, I think by the time we're done, how many people are still left to play? There's quite a few left to play. So I'll be, it'll be, I'll be lucky if I get a... I think it'll probably be like 55th. I'll probably drop down about 10 spots before it's all done. Very nice. That was a, that was a great tournament. Those are great holes. There are lots of opportunities on those holes. That was a great nine hole cup. I liked it. All right. There you have it. That's the rookie. That That's the, uh, it's a disappointing finish, but it was, I did have fun playing the, playing them. So we got that going for us. I'm going to try, even though it's really late, it's 9 o'clock at my house, so it's midnight at Dunner's. I am going to try and get a hold of Dunner one more time, and then I will play my pro account. So I'll see you on that one. Thanks for watching, and everybody have a great weekend, and uh, stay safe.